If you are going to another country and you are a new YouTuber, if in that other country you still need your studio gear and all your equipment, what could be the minimum that you can bring? I wanted to share with you what are the things that I brought, so I hope this will help you. Hi, I'm Abby. I'm an online educator. I help experts bring their expertise and experience online using videos. So I just came here to Malaysia on August 2 and I only have 25 kilos of baggage, a complimentary carry-on of 7 kilos. So I have this big studio, big in the sense that I have two 52 inches TV for my virtual events. Of course, I could not bring them. So anyway, I would be staying here only for a few weeks, but I still will be doing some YouTube videos and some online classes. So what are the minimum that I would bring? Okay, so for my gear, the most important thing, of course, is the camera. I'm using my iPhone in recording this video, but I really prefer bringing my Sony with me because if I'm filming with my iPhone and somebody calls me, then it creates a problem. And at the same time, the Sony gives a lot of high quality videos. So I prefer going with this and I should not forget the charger. I don't know if your Sony camera uses a different charger, but this, this one, uh, I should not forget it. And then I use this Elgato HD 60 S Plus, which is a capture card, a bit expensive. But the thing is it captures high quality video. So this connects my Sony to my Ecom live streaming software. And how does it connect it? I use this one here and then the other one, the other cable that I have is okay. So I have two cables that should go together. One of this goes to the camera and this other one goes to my iMac. Oh, it goes to my MacBook Pro, so it has to be attached. I also bring this one. Really, for many things, this is very helpful. So I attach this to my Mac. Okay, so I'll fix this right now. So after the camera, I have my audio equipment. So I bring my Rode Wireless Go, so it has the transmitter and the receiver. And then I only bought one of this cat skin and it should go with this, it goes with this cable and to connect with my MacBook, I have this cable. And then of course, I should not forget the cables for charging it. Well, I forgot to mention that I have the new Magnetic Go. Earlier, I used it. So, let me see. This goes in and this goes out, something like that. Of course, it has to be hidden some other time, okay? Just demonstrating that this is the one that sometimes I'm conscious I might lose it. It's a bit expensive, so I put it somewhere here. Then after the camera and the audio, the next big thing that I have to keep in mind that I should bring, these are my lights. So the newer lights that I have, Right, this one, I didn't bring any other color because I'm pretty sure that I will not be using any other color. So just this one, and I, this one's, this is going to be useful. That's why I also brought it because it can go here. Okay. So I know that in, I've had an idea that where I'm going to live, there's plenty of sunlight, but you wouldn't know I might be filming in the evening. So I use this, actually there are two. This is the other one. So I make use of half of a toilet roll for the cable to make it organized. So I put them all here. And then they go with this. Um, so this one can be, um, you can extend this and then it also goes with this stand like this. So when I would travel, I think I'm going to get this, well I just make sure I wrap them in this bubble wrap, okay, all of them. And then this is the smallest that I could bring, the tripod that I could bring with me because the one that was given for free when I bought the Sony is very big, uh, very sturdy, very durable, but 
I cannot afford that in my Java because it's, it has a lot, it occupies a lot of space. It, has, it is heavy. So I know that wherever I will go, I'll always find books that can also be useful. But at the same time, I thought that if I'm going to use my camera, both my camera and my iPhone for shooting, then I really need one tripod at least. So this is quite um quite easy to this is I think a Chinese brand. Okay, I just added this band for when I'm going to use um, road and I'm going to put that the transmitter here. Okay, so this is quite, um, let me see, I'm just going to change this. Okay, very handy, right? And then, and then I don't forget that I should bring my Ulansi I think this is a holder for my phone. I have to shoot my phone. And just in case, this is something that I haven't used so far, but just in case that I have to show something on the TV and my host does not have this, I make sure that I have this HDMI cables. And then I mentioned to you that I brought even, I even brought this because since I, I use a lot of equipment, I thought, uh, this is very helpful. So I, I placed this in my uh, check-in baggage. And this universal charger, yeah. This is the one that we use here in Malaysia. So I brought this universal charger with me. This I bring with me in my carry-on baggage, just in case I have to charge my phone or my laptop somewhere there in the airport or in the travel. I think that's it. So I hope you learned from this video. You can go into my resources page in my channel in order to again review all of these things that I have brought here and also some things that I have left behind in my studio in Manila. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.